chose to be born in a manger, he could have been born in a palace. He chose to go through things that you and I would go through and even worse. You know why I believe? Because we can never look at Jesus and say, Jesus, you don't know what I'm going through. Because he knows. And when they ripped his beard out, and then when they whipped him with that cat of nine tail, and then when they put that cross back after they had ripped the flesh off of it and he tried to carry that thing up that hill. The 
listen to me, folks. Nobody knows time. Like Jesus knows time. And in any one second, all he had to do was think thought. And the whole world would have disintegrated. He could have said, Father, they're not worth it. Let's start over. But he carried that cross with a little help up that hill. And he laid on that cross and he allowed them to drive those nails into his hands and his feet. And the only thing that kept him from ending it all was his unsurpassing love for you and for me. He loves you more than you'll ever know. You say, Brother Dave, you don't know how my life is. I, I've made a mess of my life. I'm here to tell you, we're all sinners saved by grace. But I know this. I know that Jesus loves us so much that if he could stand here in the flesh, he's here in the spirit. He's walking up and down these aisles. But if he could stand here in the flesh, I know with all the hurt he would see because he would see our hearts. He would see all the times that I've failed him. But he would still smile. And there's no doubt in my mind he would sing the song. That's a good time. Get tired, but that's okay. Cause that's a good time. That's a good time. That's a good time.